I will reveal 5 dividend paying stocks you need to buy before it's too late. Let's get straight into this video and start with the first stock. This first stock may be the most important dividend stock on my list. If not, it's definitely a top 3 dividend stock in my stock portfolio. The first stock on my list is Realty Income Corporation, ticker symbol O. This stock is considered to be a REIT stock. For those who don't know, REIT stands for Real Estate Investment Trust. So by owning this one stock, you will literally be investing your money into real estate. Have you ever wanted to get into real estate but simply don't have enough time or money to get started? Well, this is no longer a problem anymore because by simply buying Realty Income Corporation stock, you will get a taste of real estate. You see, when you buy this stock, you basically lend your money to professionals, which they will be in charge of selling and renting real estate. Think of this as a group of people, which will be the investors, like me and you. We will all come together and pitch in money and give it to a group of experienced people who are experts in the real estate game. Those experts will collect investors' money to purchase and rent out huge commercial properties. And once they sell properties to customers above their purchase price and collect the rent money on the rental properties, the money and profits will later get distributed back to the investors, which will be you and me. The rest will go back to the experts. They will be collecting their cut and continuing expanding and investing that money into real estate. And the process continues, sort of like an infinity money cycle. It almost seems illegal, but trust me, it's totally legit. Realty Income Corporation was founded in February 18, 1969. This company has been around for a very long time. In fact, it's been around for 54 years to be exact. Road to Income Corporation stock is currently selling at $59.22 during the recording of this video. This stock has an annual dividend yield of 5.21% at the moment. Road to Income Corporation pays out a dividend every single month, so you could definitely rely on those sweet dividends on a monthly and consistent basis. But when looking at the one year chart of this stock, you can see that it's currently down 19%, which is not surprising as interest rates reach an all time high in recent years. Rates have been creeping into the 7% in some areas. The good news is that interest rates can't stay high forever and I expect them to start crawling back down within the next few years, but hopefully this year. Anyways, this is a very good buying opportunity because once interest rates come back down, the stock price will likely skyrocket upwards, making you a great profit and a great return on investment. And this is why I have Realty Income Corporation at the top of my list. I'm looking out for you guys and want you to make as much money as you can in the stock market. I'm showing you guys this great long term play that will make you money if you act now. The second stock on my list is an important essential stock and a crucial sector you should definitely invest in. Investing into retail stores is important when it comes to being a reliable dividend stock. So for my second stock on my list, I will have to go with Costco stock, ticker symbol COST. Costco is a membership warehouse club which they offer pretty much everything from groceries to electronics, furniture, pharmacy, gasoline to even mechanics and so much more. It's basically a one stop shop to buy everything you need. Costco has been growing and expanding. In fact, they have 838 locations worldwide. They operate in the US, Canada, Mexico, the United Kingdom, Korea, Taiwan, Japan and Australia. And you can't ignore the famous and ridiculously cheap $1.50 hot dog combo. Huge shout out to James Seinigal, the owner of Costco, for keeping the hot dog at the same price since the year 1985. Everyone, drop a like for James Seinigal. He's been holding it down for real. Costco stock is selling at $552.04 a share and has an annual dividend yield of 0.74%. Costco has a pretty low dividend, but the growth and potential is definitely there, as it's currently up 150% in the last five years. Costco has a promising future and I only see growth within the coming years, making a very solid sector and dividend stock to invest in. The next stock is my favorite dividend stock ETF because this stock has your hands on pretty much every important sector out there. So the third stock on my list is the Schwab US Dividend Equity ETF, ticker symbol SHD. This stock is a dividend ETF, which means it holds more than one dividend stock. In fact, SHD holds 104 dividend paying stocks. Its top 10 stock holdings include companies I bet you heard before. These companies include The Home Depot, Coca-Cola, Pepsi, Chevron, and more. I will even show you guys a picture up in my screen of their top 10 holdings they invest in. The Schwab US Dividend Equity ETF holds dividend stocks that are involved in important sectors. For example, SHD highest sector is industrials, reaching 18.13% at the time of this recording. Following along is healthcare, 
financials, consumer staples, informative technology, and so on. Investing into an ETF stock like SHD is a perfect choice for any beginner investor and for any busy people who may not have enough time to analyze and checking up on their stocks. One of the many advantages you get to receive by investing into SHD is because it holds 104 dividend stocks, your investment and hard earned money will be safe during the market's volatility. And if one of those 104 stocks drops significant in value, the other stocks will make up for it, making your investment diversified into many dividend stocks and sectors. Another great thing is that this stock is managed by professionals. If one stock in their portfolio is having multiple negative ears, they will simply get replaced with another stock, getting rid of all the headaches that may come from having one bad stock in your stock portfolio. SHD is currently selling at $74.81 per share. This stock has a yearly dividend yield of 3.48% at this moment in time. SHD dividend is paid out every three months. SHD paid its shareholders a dividend yield of $2.60 per share last year. And a great thing is that you can expect the dividend growth to increase throughout the years. Did you know that the Schwab US Dividend Equity ETF had a dividend growth rate of 16.34% during the last three years? Future growth is expected and you wouldn't want this dividend ETF stock slipping away from you. With our third stock out the way, this will lead us to our fourth dividend stock. And boy was this a tough choice. I had a tough time deciding which stock to pick from since these two dividend stocks serve the same exact purpose. So for our fourth stock, it will have to be two stocks named Waste Management, ticker symbol WM, and Republic Services, ticker symbol RSG. These two stocks are identical when it comes to what their goals are. They both deal with waste disposal, recycling, waste transfer, and collection. And you can't go wrong with these two dividend stocks because they will likely never go out of business. Humans like me and you produce waste in the daily basis and someone has to take care of it. Both Waste Management and Republic Services solve this issue. So now let's get to the good stuff, which is stock prices and dividend yields. So Waste Management is currently selling at $161.50 and is paying out a dividend yield of 1.73%. While on the other hand, Republic Services stock is currently selling at $148.49 per share and has a sweet annual dividend yield at just 1.44%. Both dividend stocks are very similar, and if I have to decide which one to invest in, it would have to be both of them, for all the prior reasons. Both have the same mission when it comes to waste, and the stock is almost at the same price. So splitting up your money between these two stocks is the way to go in my opinion. And now for the last and final stock on my list. I have a pretty interesting stock humans also use on a daily basis, and that's gasoline. So it will only be right to invest into a good and well-known gas company, and that lucky company is named Chevron. Humans use gas on a daily basis, whether it is cooking or even driving your car. Investing into a gas company is a great idea, and some of you guys may think that Chevron is not built for the future of electric and green energy. So you may think that Chevron stock and the company will go into a decline in the future. And to answer this question or your thought that you may have regarding this is that I don't think so. Third world countries and developing countries will begin using gasoline to live. Green energy takes a lot of research and capital to develop. Unfortunately, developing countries may not have enough resources for high-tech machines and new technology, leaving them with gasoline for all their daily necessities. And don't worry because Chevron is currently making a shift into green and renewable energy. According to a new article from Reuters, it claims that Chevron will raise $3 billion for renewable energy. The article also mentions the following. Chevron has set a target to cut operational emissions to net zero by 2050. And in September, they pledged to invest $10 billion to reduce its carbon emissions throughout 2028, with about $3 billion earmarked for renewable fuels. Chevron is adapting for the future, so it's just another reason to invest into the stock. The stock is currently selling at $159.86 per share and has an annual dividend yield of 3.78%, which is not bad at all. Chevron stock has been killing it in recent years, and I expect the stock to continue going up. And as gas prices are in the rise, the stock will only get to benefit from it. So investing into Chevron dividend stock is a wise and smart investment for years to the upcoming decades because the company is wasting no time at all adapting for the future of energy. And with this out the way, thanks for watching and make sure you like and subscribe for more content when it comes to stocks. It's been your boy Kendrick and I'm out. Peace.